Hello, good evening, guys. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Hey, Manuel. How are you doing? Better? Ya mejor? No, no se quiere ir. Really? How many days have you been uh, sick? Five uh, days? Seven days? Correct. Y ahora estamos toda la semana. Ocho días. Diez días. Ten days. A lot of days. But isn't COVID. It's not COVID or, or yes, it is. Mm, okay. And he's going to be back. Hello, Manuel. Hello, hello. Uh, yes, my question is, uh, is it COVID? Ah, uh, no, 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 it's COVID, no. It's not COVID, okay. Okay, I hope you get better, but have you been taking medicine, right? Yeah, yeah. Incluso me regaña porque no la tomo. Yeah, <laughs> but maybe it's not working well as it should be, but I hope you get better soon. Espero que te recuperes pronto, okay? Okay, gracias. Thank you. Uh, Mercy, hello, good evening. Hi, teacher. Hello. Okay, how was your day? Uh, good, normal day. Okay, that's fine. Okay, thank you, Mercy. Carito, are you over there? Hello, teacher. Hello, good how are you? I'm fine. Okay, that, 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 that's good. And here we have Edgar. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? Uh, ahorita, la día de descanso, pero ahorita quizás un poco huevón. <laughs> okay. <laughs> With no energy, sin energía, yeah. right? Energía. Okay, okay. Uh, maybe you need a coffee or you need some energizer. Un energizante, ¿qué son necesitas? Quizás con un cafecito. Yeah, maybe a coffee. A Bien coffee pan, with, uh, with a little sugar, con poquito de azúcar. Do uh -huh. Okay, Susie Q, hello. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Um, how was your day? Normal. Normal. Did you arrive at home early? No, um, at seven o'clock. Seven o'clock. But did you have dinner? Uh, todavía no. <laughs> really? And what time are you going to have dinner after the class or during the class? Okay, right now. Creo que ahorita. Oh. So. No, perdón, perdón. Este, venía comiendo en el camino. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Okay. Okay, now you are nice. Maybe you need a coffee or some drink. Sí. Some tea. En un ratito más, ya casi está. <laughs> okay, so see, that's fine. Eh, Maritza, hello, good evening. Hello, good evening. Um, how how was your day? Um, uh, was a hard day. A hard day. Okay. Yes. <clears throat> okay. Mm. A very uh, stress, stress, stressful, mm -hmm. stressful, a stressful day. Okay, uh, I understand. Uh, those days are difficult. Son bastante difíciles esos días. Okay, yes. so I hope you can rest now. Espero que puedas descansar ahora. It is important to have rest to sleep well at night. Okay. Yes. So that, that, that's good. Um. And let's see, Mercy, could you mention your favorite toy when you were a kid? When you were five years old, maybe you remember when you were six or seven or even 10. Uh, Try to remember. I know that sometimes we don't think about it because it happened a long time ago. And maybe we don't think about it because we have a lot of... Uh, uh, a lot of responsibilities, okay? But um, 
I'm going to give you time, okay? Or you have it? No sé si le he comprendido. Este, mi edad favorita? No, toy. No. Toy es juguete. Ah. I don't okay. remember. Okay. <laughs> Try to think about it. Susie, what about you? Do you remember your favorite toy or one of your favorite um, toys? My favorite toy was a balloon. A balloon that my mother buy, bought. Bought. Bought you. Okay, a boat. Uh, when was I was it... seven years old. Seven. Uh, yes. Was it a soccer ball? No, a football. Okay. Um, how long did you have it? ¿Cuánto tiempo lo tuviste? Uh, Two years, three years. Three years. Three years, okay. Llegué hasta los diez, sí. <laughs> okay. I guess you were like playing a lot of uh, time with that ball, right? De hecho, como soy la única niña, me tocaba comprarme a, a mis hermanos. Yes, y por eso... uh, to, to, to play, play games that usually boys uh, used to play, right? Yes. In my family, we are a lot of uh, boys, a lot of men, and we are, imagine, we are 27 cousins, 27 cousins. And from those 27 cousins, just three were girls and 24 boys. So uh, when we were playing together, the girls had to play our games, right? And so that, that, that happened to you. I understand. Okay, thank you, Susi. Carito, qué creída está hoy. No, teacher, tuve problemas con la compu. <laughs> okay, but now everything okay? Yes, it's okay. Okay. Eh, se dice así, así se pronuncia, rag, rag o rag. ¿A uh, qué te refieres? A una muñeca de trapo. Ah, oh, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Sí. Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. okay. And how much time did you have it? I like to wear 60, 16, 16 years. 15 años. Yeah, 15. Mm -hmm. 15. Rug, but it's que es rug doll, porque doll es muñeca, entonces rug uh -huh. es de trapo. Mm -hmm. era, era black rug doll. Ajá. Uh -huh. A black. Era, era negra, yes. Era una negrita. My grandma likes a lot uh, like black babies or black dolls. Le gustan la, los muñecos negros, así negritos. Ajá, ella decía que... Sí. I don't Son know. Bien. Le gustaban, le gustaban de los morenos. Ajá. Sí, so yo it. tenía una. Ya yeah, well. Ok. Sí. Si es que los morenos tenemos más sabores que eso, sí es. Eso es toda, toda la vida. Ok. 15, 15 years, 15 años. ¿Y qué happened to that? Sí. Yes. Ay, ya. ¿Y qué? ¿A la basurita se fue? ¿O qué? No, se me perdió. Ah, I Así. got lost. Ok. Sí, se me perdió. Ok. Thank you. Merci. Now you, you have your favorite toy. You remember? Yes, teacher. Ok, tell me. Ahorita sí, ya me recordé. Uh, my favorite toy is... Stuffy, no sé si así se dice peluche. Teddy bear. Ah. Oh, uh -huh. ah, era, era un oso. Un... Sí, pero okay. era un pato que hablaba. A dog. Uh -huh. Yes, uh -huh. it's like teddy. Uh -huh. Es como de peluche, peluche, ajá. Uh -huh. So yes. it was a dog, ajá. Uh -huh. Sí, lo perdí una vez y sí. I remember que lloré. <laughs> yeah, you were crying because of the toy. Yes. And how old were you? Seven, five years old? Six years old. Six years, you were a kid, a baby. <laughs> okay, so you remember. Uh, did it have a name? Uh, no, solo no. Pato. Pato. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Pato, así se le dicen a mi ex cuñado. Okay, thank you. Uh, let's see, Edgar. A favorite toy that you remember? Uh, no lo recuerdo. Todavía lo tengo. Ah, okay. And what what is it? Spider ah, Spider-Man toy. Wow, that's nice. Uh, how much time does it have? Like 20 years? 15 years? No, 
18, more 18 less. years. Okay, so, yeah. okay, you have to keep it. And when you have babies, uh, you can show it to them because, uh, <laughs> yes, it, yeah, it is like. Yeah. Sí, tenía otro, pero era, ¿cómo se llama? Ese sí, no, no sé si lo perdí o qué, pero no, ya no lo volví a encontrar. El único que tengo de, es ese. Yes, sometimes we we give away, lo regalamos, uh, or mm -hmm. we, mm, it, it happened a lot of things, okay? So thanks, uh, Edgar, for showing us your Spiderman toy. <laughs> eh, Andrea, hello. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, we are talking about toys. Teacher, I don't remember. You don't remember. Creo que no tenía, no, creo que no tenía ninguno en específico. My father says that, eh, ay, no sé lo demás, que, que dice él que, que jugaba con cualquier cosa. Okay. Uh -huh. uh, with balls, maybe with, with some, uh, yeah, even with stones, a veces con piedritas, con, con, con. Yes. Um, with con wood. hojas. This is a wood, pedacitos de madera, a veces no juega, yes. So that's. Yes. Yeah. Ah, okay. You were like ecologist, mi ecologista, Andreita. So you don't remember. Mm -hmm. No, teacher. Okay. Pero que no juegues con los corazones de nadie. Okay, Andreita. Okay. So let's listen to Diana. Hello, Diana. Good evening. Hi, good evening. Um, I remember that toy. Hmm? Mm, ball. La bol. Entonces, creo que, ajá, era el mismo caso de Susi, y yo era la única. Bueno, en ese entonces eran solo dos hermanos. Así es que mm, tenía que acoplarme un poco. Ah, you had to play games uh -huh. that, that he liked, your brother uh -huh. liked. So, how Tal old were you? Uh, mm, times. ¿Cómo se dice? Bueno, no sé, yo creo que tenía como... Desde los tres años, no sé. Since three years old. Ajá. Uh -huh. Sí. <laughs> okay, so thank you. Uh, a ball, I guess it was a soccer ball. Okay. Yes, Dianita, I understand you. So you, you had to play the games that, that your brother liked. Okay, and what about Maritza? Do you remember a no. toy? Mm, yes, uh, I remember that my favorite toy was a, a doll that um, closed, closed and opened the, its uh, eyes. Mm -hmm. uh, when I... Hug it. Touch it. When it was ah, no. when. When ah, put it down. When, when I, you put it down. When you put it down. When I put it down. Put, put it down. Uh, it's uh, closed. It open its eyes. No, it's closed. Ah, it's closed. Ah, like uh, mm -hmm. he was sleeping. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, very nice. Okay, how old were you? Seven years? I think seven or eight uh, years. I don't remember. Okay, yes. Uh, that's like a common age when we remember uh, like specific toys, okay? Thank you, Maritza. Thank you for sharing. And what about Manuel? Hello, Manuel. Are you there? Hello. I uh, remember the bicycle. Mm, yeah, and, definitely a bicycle. Mm. And ball uh, for the play football. Oh, yes. Yes, for, that, that, that's very common as well. Okay, uh, how old were you? Like seven years, eight, ten years? From eight years to uh, 16. To 16, yeah. It lasted a lot. Te duró bastante. Last significa, también significa de último, último, pero también significa durar, durar. Mm -hmm. Así como dura el amor. Okay, so if I say it lasted, it lasted a lot of time or a long time, Duro, verdad? Uh, por ejemplo, if, if you are watching a movie, a person can say or can may ask, uh, how much does it last? ¿Cuánto dura? How much does it last? 
Ok. So, last um, significa durar. Ok, thank you. So, it lasted a lot of years. Thank you. Carmen, hello. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. We are talking about toys. My favorite toys. Eh, the bicycle, too. A bicycle. Yes. And you were, how, how old were you? Like 12, like 13, 11? Um, seven to 14. Seven to 14. Okay. And believe it or not, there are a lot of people who can't ride a bicycle. They can't. There are people who can't ride a bicycle and people who can't swim. For example, Diana, yeah, no, Diana, who said that? Quien dijo que no podía? There was a person who said, <laughs> Yo no puedo nada. I'm sorry, Anita, pero no te voy a la playa. I'm sorry. No. Okay. Andrea, yes. No. Okay. Carmen, can you swim? Intenté, teacher, intenté, pero fracasé. Así de, así decimos todos en el amor. Ok. Oh, but maybe you can go to classes, so swimming. Mm. In classes? Yo le puedo dar clase. Así. I'm virtual. not because eh, floto o no me, no me uno, no sé cómo se dice. You float. You don't float. No flotas. No, sí, yo sí. Ajá, porque sink es hundirse. Uh -huh. You sink, te hundes en la depresión. Ok. <laughs> Okay, okay, but you don't see, you can float. Susie, can you swim? No. Like doggy style, como perrito? <laughs> no, no, no puedo, I can. Aunque sea no. de perrito, eso les puede salvar la vida. No. Como es, me hundo. <laughs> I sink. I sink. I sink Definitely in tears. Definitely I sink, yeah. I sink in tears, me hundo en lágrimas. Okay, Carito, can you swim? Yes. Mm, good. That lo vas a salvar a todos. Okay. Fine. Um, what about uh, Elsa? Could you mention your favorite toy? Hi, teacher. No, we are talking about toys. Hey. From our childhood. ¿Cómo se dice de todo un poco? <laughs> I play with a my bit brothers. Of everything, a bit of everything. I've never seen with my brothers a soccer, bicycle, chivola, marbles, yo yo, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> what? Yo yo. Ah, yo yo, huh? Trompo. Sí, trompo. Okay. But my favorite, my favorite was. was um, Soccer. Soccer. Uh, similar to Susie, that she used to play yeah. soccer a lot. And a ver si no eran leñeras. Dianita as well. <laughs> so, leña fina. Yes, okay. So, thank you. And what about Kevin? Hey, Kevin. Hello there. Hey, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. We are talking about toys from our childhood. Do you remember yes. yours? Yes. Uh, I really like a remote control car that my father has given me. Yeah. I, I yeah. guess mm -hmm. I guess remote control cars wa were the best present, the best gift. Era como los mejores regalos que podía recibir. Yes. Yeah. Mm, amazing. <laughs> okay. Good. Thanks. And what about well, Helen? I guess Helen is is uh walking. Maritza, can you swim? No. 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 Okay, by now just Carito can. Manuel, can you swim? More or less. More or less is more or less. Okay. <laughs> and what about Elsa? Can you swim? Okay, maybe. Kevin, can you swim? Solo una de sus mentiras, una vez, este chico, okay. pero... Ok, lo que dijiste, por dos, por dos. Sí, bueno. sí okay. bueno. Ok, good. Pero pudiste, a ver, ok. Y sobreviviste, te felicito, eres muy valiente. Ok, what about... Um, Mercy, can you swim? Ok, I guess, maybe. 
So if we have a trip to the to, to the pool, to any pool or beach, uh, you're going to be on the corner. Van a estar en esquinitas agarraditas, va a estar Diana, sí, Andrea, sí. Okay. <laughs> so, well, you should you should learn because of the babies, because of your nephews or or mm -hmm, or niece. Por los primitos, los, los no, primitos. mi hijo de hecho sí sabe porque él sí lo, lo pusimos en una Lo enviaste, clase. lo enviaste Ajá. a clase. Best, yes. Hey, remember that there are some kids that they are very, they, they do pranks. Pranks. Que significa bromas, pranks, travesuras. So they, 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 they do pranks, especially when they are in the pool, and they pull. Right? No, I'm sorry, they push boys into the pool. A veces empujan los niños en la, en la piscina. That's really dangerous. So it is important that kids can swim in any case, in cualquier caso. Okay, yes, that's important. That's one of the main abilities in life that we all should know. Creo que todos deberíamos de saber eso en, en cualquier caso. Okay, so that's it. Okay, um, we are finishing unit two. It means that we are in the middle of the course. Estamos al final del curso, mi gente. So after this, we're having 10 classes. Después de esto, te vamos a tener 10 clases. And it means that um, we have to continue in a higher level. Vamos a seguir en siguiente nivel. Unit two, review and practice. Okay, so ways to say, I agree with you. Formas para decir, estoy de acuerdo contigo. If you remember the last course, we were talking about I agree, I disagree, or I don't agree. So you can say, besides saying I agree with you, you can say no doubt about it. No doubt about it. Sin duda, sin duda, ¿verdad? No doubt about it. And for example, you can say... Mo mom mothers are angels. Las mamás son como ángeles. You can say no doubt about it. Okay. So that's it. I'm with you. ¿Verdad? Soy contigo. If you say, for example, mm, kids need love. Kids need love and comprehension. Los niños necesitan amor y comprensión. I'm with you. Estoy de acuerdo contigo. If you say, uh, there are no there are no bad learners but bad teachers no hay malos estudiantes sino malos maestros you can say ah you have a point there yes and i i really believe that yo realmente creo en eso también and that it applies for fathers and mothers okay because kids can be educated right they, they are like a, a, a big stones in uh, it can turn into a, a, a beautiful sculpture. Puede, un, es un, como, como una piedra. Y van esculpiéndola. Así son los niños. Y pueden terminar siendo una obra maestra o realmente, pues, un desastre. But that's, that depends on the parents. Eso depende de los papás. 100%. 100%. Okay. Then, tell me about it. Tell me about it. No necesariamente quiere decir... Cuéntame sobre eso. Mm, tell me about it. Uh, you can say that you agree with that person and I couldn't agree more. I couldn't agree more. No podría estar más de acuerdo. I couldn't agree more. For example, you can say the minimum salary should be higher. El salario mínimo debería ser más alto. I couldn't agree more. That's another point, okay? So here we have no doubt about it. You can say about it. But about it, esto, cuando la T se pronuncia como R, ya suena como inglés más norteamericano. No doubt, doubt, doubt about it. I'm with you. No, I'm, I'm with you. No, I'm with you. I'm with you. You have a point there. Tell me about it. Otra vez, about it. I couldn't agree more. Okay, so Maritza, pick one and pronounce it. Then Susi, please. I couldn't agree more. Thanks. Uh, Susi Caro. I'm with you like the song of April Lavigne. Yeah, I really love I really love that song. Yes. Uh, I don't know if that's from the 90s, no sé si de los 90s or at the beginning of the 2000s, quizá el inicio del 2000 creo que fue. I don't remember. Yes, it's like a 
and I love the, the, the video as well. Very good one. Thank you for remembering me. That to see. Carito and Manuel. No time about it. Mm -hmm. Manuel, Kevin. And with you. Good. Uh, Kevin, Andrea. I'm with you. Okay, Andrea, Diana. Tell me about it. Good. Diana, Carmen. I couldn't agree more. Good. Carmen, Edgar. I'm with you. Good. Edgar, and then uh, Mercy. And tell me about it. Good. Mercy, Elsa. I couldn't agree more. Good. Elsa, Helen. Tell me about it. Hmm? And Helen. I with you. Okay. Good. So um, we're going to continue with a worksheet related to the the last classes. Here we have, as I have been reminding you, como estaba recordándoles, we have present with ID or irregular irregular verbs. Pueden ser con ed que son regulares o irregulares. Didn't para negative, for negative, and did for questions, okay? We're going to work with questions. Vamos a trabajar con preguntas. Since the last class, we didn't uh, study it profoundly. So, uh, I need you to use did at the beginning of these sentences, did. And in here, you should pick uh, this verb. Remember, don't use to. No vamos a utilizar este to. Okay, porque eso solo fue una clase para los infinitivos. In this case, just uh, you have to use did at the beginning and the verb similar to the way it is presented in the parentheses. Okay, so we start with Susie and then Diana. En pas, ¿verdad, teacher? In the past. Yes, vaya, como estamos en el okay. pasado, eh, como estamos mm -hmm. en el pasado, los verbos no se modifican. El, mm -hmm. mismo, el mismo did hace que se modifique el verbo. Mm -hmm. Entonces, es fácil, right? Okay. Did you close the door? Easy peasy, right? Good to see. Uh, Diana, Andrea. And did Ronald visit the tower in London? Perfect. Andrea, Carmen. Did the boy jump into the lake? Good. Uh, Carmen Carito. Seven. Did she make the invitation card herself? Herself. Herself, herself significa ella misma. O lo hizo ella. So thank you. Okay, uh, Carito, and then we go with Kevin. Number eight. Did Ronald visit the girl drop the ketchup bottle? Bottle, bottle. Pueden decir bottle, bottle. o bottle. Mm -hmm. bottle. Drop significa derramar. También significa gota. Drop es derramar. Okay. And Kevin, and then Edgar. Okay, number, number 10. Mm -hmm. Is did they practice karate this morning? Good one. Thank you. Edgar, and then Manuel. Okay, number two. Mm -hmm. uh, did Claire uh, finish the housework? Good one. Okay, Manuel, and then Helen. Number nine. Mm -hmm. Did Tim uh, buy the green T-shirt last Monday? Okay, good one. Okay, Helen, and after Helen, we're having Mercy. Number three. Okay. Did he have a bar yesterday? Mm -hmm. Se bañó él. Okay, good. And Mercy. Number six. Six. Did Peggy and Olivia look after the baby? Mm -hmm. Good. Look after significa cuidar. Thank you, Mercy. Okay. Se dan cuenta. If you notice in present, we use do and does. En presente utilizamos do, does, utilizamos do, eh, don't, doesn't, utilizamos es para las terceras personas. Si se not, si lo notan, if you notice, the present, the simple present is the most, is the most complicated. 
es el más complicado. Tiene bastantes detallitos. In the past, it is like uh, easier, un poquito más fácil. The only detail, the only detail is the irregular and regular verb. Solo los verbos regulares y irregulares. Es lo único de ahí lo demás. And the future, it's easiest. Es el más fácil el futuro porque solo lo utilizamos will y ya pasó. Will y ya está todo en futuro. Ese es el que más me gusta. Okay. And we have some other sentences. So in this, um, we have to unscramble the sentences. Vamos a ordenarlas. And always we're going to use did. Siempre vamos a utilizar did. Okay. And the sentences are not in order. So you have to order them and just add did. Solo agregan el did. Okay. That's easy. And before we continue, I'm going to check the attendance. Attendance list, please. So say hello if you're there. Merci. Go. Present teacher. Thanks a lot. Andrea. I'm here. You're there. Carmen. Carmen Sira, I didn't hear you. Present teacher. Okay, good. Mejor la voy a, voy a seguir después porque en la otra actividad necesito que se enfoquen más. Ya me acordé. Ok, Carmencita, contigo me quedo. Después sigo con los demás con la attendance list. Ok, and here we have the sentence. Helen, please help me number one and then pick another. Menciona la uno y después me eliges otro. Ok, did Ana. Did Ana open the window. Ajá, now pick another. Ahora selecciona otro. Uh, number two. Number two. Uh, did she walk home? Walk home. Walk home. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Now we're going to listen to Susie Q. Then Elsa. Okay. Number three. Did you work in the garden? Perfect. Ah, no pregunta, perdón. <laughs> yes. Did you work? Mm -hmm. Así estaba bien, Susie. Seguiste tu corazón. La hiciste. Okay. Elsa and then Maritza. Number 10, hmm? did, did the car stop at the corner? Perfect. Maritza and then Edgar. And number four, hmm? did you sing a song? <laughs> did you sing a song? Ajá. Sing es cantar y song, canción. Okay, uh, who's next? Edgar and then Kevin. Mm, number five, mm -hmm. did she sit on a chair? Yes, on the chair, chair, como la cantante. Thank you, Kevin, and then Carmen. Number six, mm -hmm. did you visit the castle? Okay, good, the castle, perfect. Okay, Carmen and Diana. Did Jenny lock the door? Mm -hmm. Good, lock significa cerrar, con llave. Close, eh, cerrar, eh, tenemos lock y tenemos la otra que es shut. Es esta. Shut también significa cerrar. Por eso cuando dicen shut up es cállate. O sea, cierra el, la boquita. Ok. So that's it. So shut is cerrar y lock también, pero es cerrar con llave. Uh -huh. Close es solo simplemente okay. cerrar. Ok. So who's next? Who's next? ¿A quién había dicho? Janita. Sí. Yes, please. Please, please. Uh, this is Greg. Greg. And yes. Kick the ball. Good one. Okay. And for this last sentence, we're having Carito. Okay. Did she be happy? Casi, casi, Carito. Me gusta que inventes, pero tampoco tanto. ¿Cuál es el pasado de D, de B? Sorry. R. R. No, sí, ¿verdad? No, el pasado. El pasado de B es am, um, is, are. Vaya, dije are. Pero estamos en pasado, en el pasado, recordando los viejos amores. Para eso tenemos was y tenemos were. Yes, ¿Qué te so. dice tu corazón? Was. Hmm. Was. Was she happy? Yes. Fíjense Sorry. que... Eh, está bien, carito, tranqui, relax. Lo que pasa es que no hemos explorado... El verbo lo vamos a explorar a partir de mañana. Porque sí, eso confunde un poquito. ¿Verdad? 
Entonces el be ahí no se ocupa como en presente, sino que no, es el auxiliar. No. Y le voy a poner un claro ejemplo por qué no. Vale. Andrea, ¿cómo digo yo no soy estudiante? Ah, yo no soy doctor. Yo no soy doctor. I am not a doctor. Ok. Podría decir, I don't am a doctor. ¿Puedo decir eso? Mm, bueno, sí lo puedes decir. No. Lo puedes decir, pero no es correcto. Ajá, no es not correct. No es correcto. Ahora, es co decir, I, I don't am a doctor, es como decir, I didn't am a doctor. I didn't was. Ya. Yeah. Para el verb be, siempre se va a utilizar eh, not. ¿Ok? Pero eso lo vamos a ver mañana. ¿Ok? Mañana voy a presentarles esto para que tengamos más claro. ¿Verdad? Porque Susi como que, ¿what? No, no entendí la verdad. Bye. Eh, tomorrow. Okay, Malvado tomorrow. hasta respira profundo. ¿Mm? ¿Yo? <risa> ¿Por qué? No, 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 no. Mal Porque pensado. lo pone atrás es tricky. Yo, tricky. Sí. Tricky era mi ex cuñado. Ok. Eh, okay. Vamos. ok, we continue. Where did you grow up? Pero antes de eso, vamos. Necesito que aquí pongamos atención. It's a puzzle. ¿Verdad? Para esto. Fíjense eh, que se me movió esto. Esto no era así. No era parte del show esto. Ok, yes, yes. Bien, uh, this is a, a, a puzzle. Es un tanto difícil eh, que ustedes me, 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 lo, me lo subrayen o me, me, me digan. Así que vamos a utilizar. We're going to say number, number one and the letter. Me dicen el número y me dicen la letra y yo voy a intentar buscarlo. Ok, that's it. Susi va a ser la primera porque Susi le gusta. Ya no sé por qué, siendo que Susi <ríe> no era de los niños que agarraba el periódico y hacía esas cosas. Ok. Yo sí, yo sí hacía eso, me encantaba hacer eso. Ok, but uh, vamos a recordar viejos tiempos. Ok, but before that, uh, here we have the clues. Industry, staff, networking, branch, guests, no, west, guests, west es oeste. Headquarters, small talk, manufacture, personnel, expertise. Expertise es eh, experiencia, ok. Como nosotros decimos, experticia. Ok. Relax, carito, relax, <laughs> mujer. Yes, ok, you can start, but, <laughs> but, but calm down. Clap, relax. Well, I'm going to check the attendance. Le voy a pasar la lista de asistencia. Es que me la van a ganar, hombre. Shut up, la... baby. Ay, relájate, que te van a ganar. Mira, el hecho de que nos hayan ganado muchas cosas en la vida no quiere decir que te vamos a ganar aquí. So, relax, calm down, calm down. Uh, Claudia, are you there? I'm, go I'm checking the attendance list. No, no. Uh, Carito. Thank Hello. you. You're there. Maritza. Hello. Hello there. Christian, no Christian. Diana. Present. Ah, Christian. Present. Thank you, Christian. Thank you, Diana. Edgar, yes, right? Present. Go on. Elsa. Present teacher. Good. Helen. Present teacher. Nice. Jonathan, I, I, I guess I saw Jonathan there trying to connect. He's trying to connect his audio. Kevin, hello. Hello, teacher. Okay, good. Luis, no Luis. Manuel. I'm here. You're there. Marlon, no Marlon for tonight. And Susie Q. Okay, Present. Carito says, hello, Susie Q. Carito dice, me la van a ganar, dice. ¿Cómo que es? Oferta. Ok. <risa> Se me van a adelantar, pues, mae. Te van a dejar silbando en el lomo. Cabal. Ok. Se te, va, yeah. se te va a caer el zapote en la mano. Ok, uh, remember to say <risa> across, si es eh, horizontal, down, si es vertical. Ok, como que estoy haciendo la, la bendición. Ok, across and down. Ok, okay. So, Carito and then Susi. Ok, eh, number 11. 11. 11. Uh -huh. eh, across. 
Okay, across. Mm -hmm. What letter? Um, A. Mm -hmm. What's the word? A. Aquí, aquí no hay ninguna A. No. A. No, for A. E. E, 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 E. Mm -hmm. What's the word? Expert, expertise. 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 Okay, good. Thank you. Perfect. Good. Susi, recordan sus viejos tiempos cuando jugaba puzzle. Okay, uh, across one, mm -hmm. letter S. S. Before, uh -huh, yep. Uh -huh. What's the Before word? The letter. Small, small talk. Ah, yo, pensé small era, talk. yo pensé que era la otra. Okay. Ajá. Uh -huh. Small talk. Small talk. Yeah. Good one. Small talk is out. Okay. And what about Andrea? And then we're having Helen. Okay. Uh, number 12. 12. Letter H. H. Ajá. Uh -huh. Headquarters. Ah, sería up, aquí sería hacia arriba. Uh -huh. Headquarters. Good, Andrea. Ya ven que le sirven mis clases y dicen que no. Ok. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, the next we're having Helen and then Diana. Um, number eight. Number, number eight. Number two. What letter? Number nine. Nine, aha. Uh -huh. uh, T? T. Yes. Branch. Uh -huh. Tranch. Branch. P. Ok. Mira, uh, si decís ranch, si decís ranch es la salsita, ranch. Ok. Branch. Ok. Ay, que por cierto me gusta esa salsa. I really like those salsa. Ok, Branch. Thank you, Helen. Ya me dio hambre por tu culpa. Diana, esa mujer seria. Vamos a ver acá. What number? Number two. Uh, down. Down. What letter? Manufa M. Manufacture. Manufacture. Yes. Perfect. Good one. Ok. Um, after this, we're having... What about Carmen and then Luis? Number one, personal. Personal. Ah, ibas tú, Kevin. No. No, teacher. Pero okay. igual ya no. <laughs> ya te la ganaron. I'm sorry. What? Okay, uh, personal. I'm sorry. What? Number one. Number one, P. Right, person. Te la ganaron, te Kevin. Pobrecito. Se me ha que lo han lastimado mucho. Okay, and Luis. Hello there, Luis. How are you doing? Hey, hello. I'm so sorry for late because I really need working. Uh, the number 12, Steph, staff. Staff, 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 staff. And the number 12 uh, from ahí hacia, uh -huh. yes. staff. Yes. Ah, yes. Good. Okay, staff. Yes. Thank you. And after this, we have industry and guest. What about Edgar? And what about if Mercy? Okay, Edgar, industry or guest? Uh, industry. Mm -hmm. Number yeah. and letter. Number three. Uh, letter, letter I, yes. ¿Quién está haciendo esto? No sé, no. tú, Christian. Industry, ok. No sé quién en el módulo pasado hacía eso, que me rayaba la pizarra. Pero bueno, yo también. era. ¿Ah? Yo era. Cogera. Que cuando ¿Sí? le rayen el cuaderno uno es porque ya saben que si. Las mañas de la escuela. ¿eh? Sí, <risa> ve, pues, ve, pues. Oh, okay. <risa> me recuerda cuando fueron infiel conmigo. Te rayen el cuaderno. Ok, guest. Eh, who's, who's the, the other? Ted Garambo. <risa> Edgar, eh, who was? Mercy, Mercy, guest. No, you... teacher. No, okay. <laughs> la que no había visto me dejaron. Dabre, teacher, dabre. Okay. 
Eh, ok. Tenía aquí, pero Lo siento, estoy tratando es, de, de... La vida es así, no la he inventado yo, como dice la canción. Sí. Oh, no la veo. veo. Manuel, do you got it? Do you have it? Para, uh, What number? number? Two. Number two, para la compañera le estaba diciendo ahí. Number two, letter. Sí. Igual que está. Ajá, mm. correcto. Number two. Number two, uh, letter G o G? Guess. Guess. No, 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 no. Oh, ah, yeah. Backwards, backwards. Guess. Sí, yes. ¿Cómo se dice de derecha a izquierda? Ya le digo, le digo. You can say, se dice así, ¿ver? For Forward. forward es así, normal, y la otra es backward. O pueden decir from the right to the left or from the left to the right, pero es más, más largo. Ya. Yeah. ¿Verdad que forward es retroceder también? Forward es adelantar y backward es retroceder como en el VHS. No sé si se recuerdan eso. Bueno, yo porque ya soy más prehistórico. From the right to the left. O pueden decir from the left to the right, ¿verdad? Derecha, izquierda. Even there are some people who get confused with right and left. Hay gente que se confunde con la derecha, izquierda. Yes. Um, I, I, once I had a, a module at the university, tuve una, un módulo en la universidad. I was teaching English, basic English. And I did a dynamic, a, a game. And I said, okay, raise your right hand. Y les dije, levanten su mano derecha. Y estaban levantando la izquierda. Y le dije en español, levante su mano izquierda, ah, derecha, perdón, y levanta mano izquierda. O incluso hay gente que no sabe qué es índice o pulgar. Perdón, índice, meñique, pulgar, hasta yo me confundo. Meñique, pulgar, índice, el medio. Ajá. Come on, Hablar. teacher. No he comido, como, como ciertas personas acá. Ok, so, yo les recomiendo forward, backward. Ese es más fácil, forward, backward. Ok. O pueden decir reverse, de reversa, mami. ¿Cómo es la, la canción? Okay. Reverse, ¿qué es esto? Uh -huh. Y esto. Y está vice versa. No es tan común, pero se utiliza vice versa. Ajá. Oh, yo prefiero reverse. Ok, my friends, my dear friends. I don't know Sorry. Me faltó una palabra. Mm, sorry, sorry. Ahorita. Networking. ¿Cuál, ¿Cuál faltó? Networking. ¿La tenés, Diana? Que es, estaba number two. Uh, ahí me confundí. Uh, no, number eleven. Uh, N. Para arriba. Up. Bárbara Diana, no debería de estar en control de calidad para ver las galladas. Ahí deberías de estar tú. Ok, thank you, Tenita, networking. Vaya, Diana hacía la, las, las crucigramas y todo eso, quizás. Thanks. Where did you grow up and what do you remember the most? Because sometimes you can remember a tree, you can remember a dog, un chucho, or you can remember a neighbor, a bad neighbor. Pueden recordar un vecino que sea malo, a person who used to steal your balls, algunos que robaban las pelotas, or maybe a shop, a special, or the, a person in church of selling tortillas, una persona que vendía tortillas, I don't know, there are some things that we remember, we have like a picture in our head of that memory, so that happens, that is really common, in my case, yes, I, I do remember like three things from a childhood, Okay, so let's listen to Carmen. Where did you grow up and what do you remember the most? I grew up in Nahuatlpa. Mm -hmm. And what I remember the most are the tradition of the lanterns. Mm -hmm. the, the, the walks to the park. Mm -hmm. And uh, listen, were there like parades? Eran como procesiones o desfiles? No. The, la, the tradition. Yes. No, los farolitos. Ah, uh, yes, yes, yes. Yes, but is it that like a, 
a parade, es como una procesión, ¿verdad? Como un desfile que hace. No, mm, no really. No really. Ah, ok. A decoration of the it is for the church. Mm -hmm. And the house. It has candles, polish. right? Candles from different colors with paper. It's decorated yes. with the... Mm. the mm. Uh, this month. Ah, for... It's, um, does it have like holidays on on October? No. In September. Enero. Can And I? you said this month, como dijiste, this month, este mes. No, dijiste. La, the tradition of the winter, sí. Yes, okay. Okay. Y, y eh, and with the, and Christmas with the, with my family, the grandparents. Ah, that's wonderful to spend time Christmas, especially when you are a kid and you have your cousins, you have a lot of food, you have fireworks, the fireworks, the yes. <laughs> yes, y ustedes y se le revienta uno en la mano, yeah, there are a lot of things. Y a se le of... quemaba el estreno. Yeah. <laughs> yes, that was really sad, era triste, when you have like a, a shirt or a blouse that you love, And because of the fire or the fireworks, it got burned. Se quemaba y se le hacía. I had one. Se me hizo un hoyito. It was a hole. Y no lo podía tapar. I was really sad. Estaba bastante triste. Okay. So thank you, Carmen, for your lantern uh, stories from your fireworks. Se me ha que te quemaste alguna vez. Pero no way. Teacher. Yes. Sorry. ¿Qué, ¿Qué significan estas preguntas? No sé si las he entendido mal. ¿Dónde creciste? ¿Y qué recuerdas más? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Sí, thank you. <laughs> ah, pues vos va. Nada, quiere, nada, quiere. Ok, what about Luis? Pobre Susi, ahorita está haciendo la tarea, ya la vi. Ya le vi el plante. No, ya la tengo de hecho, pero no sé si yo la había entendido mal porque empezaron a hablar de otras cosas que me quedé igual. <laughs> Sigue tu corazón, mujer. Ahí está la respuesta a todo. Okay, Luis, and then Christian. Okay, where did you grow up? I uh, I grew in up. I grew Santa up. Tecla. Grew up. I grew up. up. I grew up uh, in Santa Tecla. I I don't know. Maybe it's my 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 in my imagination. In imagination uh, my imagination, but I remember my grandmother and sit on the table and she give me a uh, food with a uh, the spoon oh, with a fork tenedor con, fork? Ten, con una cuchara huh? spoon Pre cuchara with, uh, a, with a spoon yeah uh, i don't know maybe it's is my, my my imagination or is a memory but that is my no sé, de eso me acuerdo. It's, it's a mind picture, una, una imagen mental that you have it. It is like a picture. And you, you, you remember that. You yeah, were very, very young. Estaba bien, bien jovencito. You were a kid. Mm, maybe four years. Ya tenía 15. <laughs> no, oh, no, cuatro. four years. Four. four years. Yes. But I, eh, o sea, yo crecí con mi abuela desde mm -hmm. los, desde six months. Six months. Ah, ok. At uh, seven years. Okay. Uh, she. You can say she raised me. Ella me crió. Yes. Raised, she raised me. Criar. Raised she raised me. me. Yes. In my case as well, my grandma raised me. Mm -hmm. So that's why we have like memories. Okay. Okay, that, that's fine, Santa Tecla. And you remember that she was like feeding you, te estaba feed, es alimentado. She was feeding you with a spoon. With okay, a spoon. spoon. Folk significa tenedor, a knife, a cuchillo. Okay, so that's it. Thank you, Liz, for your nice memory. That's a, a good one. Christian, your turn. And then uh, after that, we're having Maritza. Okay. I grew up in a rural place called uh, Montimar. I'm uh, sorry, Montimar. Montimar. 
de road eh, o, o camino al, al puerto de la libertad. Mm. Pass by, pass by eh, a popa, or what? No, la libertad. Ah, la libertad, sorry. Mm -hmm. Sí, yes. Eh, quiero ver. What I remember most is the view from my house to, to the sea. No sé si, si se dice mar. Sí. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Sí. Ajá. At night you can see the lights of the boats. Mm. Oh, that's había, nice. Había buena vista. <laughs> and, and, and what I, I guess it is a hot place. Really hot place. No, not really. Hola. Era caliente ahí el lugar. Yes, sí está. Yeah, because next to the la no, libertad. No, 10 min minutos del puerto. Mm -hmm. Sí. Certo. Okay. Okay. So thanks, yeah. Christian, for the memory, and that's a good memory. Well, uh, a good view to see the lights from the boats, las luces de los botes. Interesting. Okay. And since there were no lights, no, como no había más luces, you can see the stars, right? So, yes, that, that's a, a good landscape. Landscape is firmamento, una gran pista. For example, you go to the Pital, you go to El Mirador, La Puerta del Diablo, or different places, you can see landscape. Okay, son como vistas, como... como, como. Sí, incluso la... Una de las mejores vistas o landscape sería la, la puesta del sol, no sé mm, qué Yes, yes. yes. Que ahí cabal se lograba ver cómo se ocultaba en la, en la montaña. Ok, eh, a eso se le llama, vaya, sunrise significa cuando, when the, when the sun is appearing y tenemos sunset. Y tenemos el sunset, ok. Sunrise and rise, como levantarse. Sunrise and sunset. Okay. So that's it. For example, the, 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 the most beautiful landscape is the sunrise. Ah, no, the sunset. Cuando el sol se oculta, ¿verdad, Christian? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, yes. Yes, I have seen some sunsets uh, near the, the Libertad or in any sea or any beach. And yes, so it's wonderful. It's, it's uh, beautiful. Okay, thank you, Christian. And who's next? Maritza, right? And then Helen. Yes. Please, go ahead. Okay, I, I grew up, grew up, mm -hmm. grew up. I yes. grew up in the countryside, okay. in a can, canton called Casitas in Texas de Peque. Mm -hmm. And that I remember most are the afternoons when we went out with my cousins to play Poisonel ball in the street. Okay, Texas Yes, I have I have been there just once when I was today. Okay, just you, you remember that with your cousins, con tus primos. Yes. Mm, interesting. Yes. I, I guess you had a lot of space. Creo que tenían bastante espacio, right? A lot of space. Yes. One of the best things to grow to grow up in the countryside. If you have a lot of space, there are a lot of trees, you can go to the river, right? Yes, that, that's, that's amazing, mm -hmm. definitely. Okay, thanks uh, Maritza. And, and on the contrary, if you grow up in the, in the city, uh, in the suburbs or in, in the suburbios, the space is narrow, es bien reducido. So you can go to a park or you can go to a soccer field, pueden ir a una canchita, but it is not the same. Even in the countryside, you can go uh, on foot, naked, uh, se refiere a descalzo, and that's different to feel the, 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 the land, the earth, sentir la tierrita. Yes, it is really, it's totally different. Okay, Elsa, please. Are you there, Elsa? Okay, if not, we're going to listen to Andrea. Please, Andrita. Okay. I grew up in San Salvador and I remember that my siblings didn't like to play with me because I was the small, smallest. Smallest. La más chiquita y la más malilla, sí. okay. 
Ajá. The, es lo que le hablamos de smallest. Lo superlativo, ¿verdad? Era la más chiquitita. Uh -huh. So you were out. Estabas como fuera. Oh, pobrecita. A la hora de correr. Ay, Dios. Fracasaba. Ay. Te trabaja rápido, pobrecita. Ajá. Por eso que no te incluían. Andreita, ok. Ok, so, well, here we have some, thank you, Andrea. Ah, what part of San Salvador, Andrea? Um, in San Bartolo. Mm -hmm. But now, now, do you live in San Bartolo? Yes. yes. Oh, ok. It's the same house, la misma casa. Yes. Ok, that's nice. So you have a lot of memories from that house, <laughs> the street. Ok. Thanks, Andreita. Good. So here we have uh, some vocabulary. Sunrise. Cuando sale sol. Sunset. Cuando se oculta. Spoon. Um, eh, tenemos que escuchar. The smallest. Fold. Knife. Aquí esta, la K, es silent letter. No se dice K, knife. No. Knife. Knife. Ok. Eh, folk. Eh, she raised me. Feed. See. Landscape. Ok. Good one. We did this and, and here we have write five information questions in the simple present use the verbs from the box. But, um, okay, we're going to do this later. Lo vamos a hacer un poquito después. Eso porque tenemos otra actividad relacionada a este vocabulario. Okay, we're having some listening. So, uh, this is a, a brief listening, okay? A short conversation, una conversación bien corta. Just give me a second. Okay, let's listen. Hi, excuse me. Yes. Where's the library? The library is next to the registration office. Ah, oh, sorry, I'm new. Where's the registration office? No problem. See the building over there? Yes. Okay, so that's the lecture theater. Next to that, on the right, is the registration office. And next to that is the library. I see. Thanks. Okay. We're going to listen again. Hi, excuse me. Yes. Where's the library? The library is next to the registration office. Ah, oh, sorry, I'm new. Where's the registration office? No problem. See the building over there? Yes. Okay, so that's the lecture theater. Next to that, on the right, is the registration office. And next to that is the library. I see, thanks. Okay, this is an easy uh, conversation. We're listening to Helen and then Manuel. Okay, Helen. Uh, excuse me. Mm -hmm. Hi. Yes. I knew. Mm, no problem. Okay. Sorry. Next office. Thanks. Okay, a very easy conversation, right? A very basic. Okay, Manuel and then Kevin. Uh, the library, uh, library, parece que dijo, uh, excuse me, uh, parece que preguntó dónde estaba la ley. Where mm -hmm. the, the library, parece que dijo, yeah. esas, sí. 
Okay, good one. Um, what about uh, Kevin and then Mercy? Okay, yo eh, logré entender como que le estaba preguntando por una dirección o por algún lugar. Uh -huh. Y puede identificar palabras como Hi, excuse me, excuse me, did I put it? No problem. Eh, see the building of the door. Eh, nice. Okay. Good one. Uh, merci. And then Carito. Do you like office? See you in next two. Okay, good. And Carito. Okay, excuse me, the library registration office, the layer layer, uh, in IC. And I see. Okay, good. Um, is there another word, um, Susie? Okay. If not, Diana, is there another word that uh, the rest of your classmate didn't mention? Mm, no problem. Mm -hmm. Okay, good, thanks. Okay, here we have student and student B, there are two students in which they are um, asking about, uh, Kevin says, some instructions or directions. So uh, we're going to listen again. Hi, excuse me. Yes. Where's the library? The library is next to the registration office. Ah, oh, sorry, I'm new. Where's the registration office? No problem. See the building over there? Yes. Okay, so that's the lecture theater. Next to that, on the right, is the registration office. And next to that is the library. I see. Thanks. Okay, so uh, can you see? Como pueden ver, um, hubo una palabra que no se pronunció. See the big building. Dijo, see the building. Mm -hmm. Así que hubo como que tenían hambre. So, we're going to practice this quickly. Vamos a practicar esto rápidamente. Okay, so I need to have a screenshot. This is the short, uh, ver, a really short conversation. Uh, you're going to take like one, uh, it is like 34, 33 seconds. Tienen como 33 segundos esta, esta conversación. So, I'm going to uh, create the breakout rooms. So please have a screenshot. We don't have Marlon tonight for sharing this conversation into the WhatsApp group. So please have a photograph or a screenshot because uh, this uh, conversation is not included in the manual. No está incluido en el manual. All right. Um, You're not going to take more than two minutes. Esta sí realmente no va a tomar más. No te va a tomar más de dos minutos. So. Teacher. Yep. Eh, hay una frase que no, no entiendo. Uh -huh. En ese. En ese eh, la última participación del estudiante B. Uh -huh. Yep. Ahí me pierdo con, eh, con esa, con esa eh, traducción. Le dice, ok, eh, que si conoces el teatro de lectura. Uh -huh. A la par de eso, en esa, a la derecha. Ajá. En, en la, en, Next to en that, la, a la par de eso, ajá. A la derecha, a la derecha. A la derecha. Ajá, a la derecha. En, en, la oficina de registro, en la oficina de registro, digamos, a la par está la librería. Ajá, Así. dice, next, a la par de eso, a la derecha, está la oficina de registro. Y a la par de eso está la librería. Ok. Uh -huh. And see the big building. ¿Qué es building? Building. Building, building. es edificio. Building. building. Over building. there. La, ah, U, okay, okay. la U, the, the letter U. The vowel U is a silent letter, so you don't know how to pronounce. So building, building, building. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. 
Okay, if you have any other question, please go ahead. Mm, let me see. Okay, see you in a moment. Yo sí, está solita, pobrecita. Ok, um, démosle, como dicen. Mm -hmm. Ok, let's go. Yo sí, I can hear you. Ya, yeah, hoy sí. Hoy sí. Este, ¿Estuve en B o.? Tú comienzas. Okay. Hi, excuse me. Yes. Where's the libra li library? Library. Library. The library. It's next to the registration office. Ah, sorry. I knew. Where was the reg registration office? Regis. 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 Registration okay. office. Mm -hmm. No problem. See the big building over there? Yes. Okay, so that's the lecture theater. Next to that, on the right, it's the registration office. And next to that is the library. I see, thanks. Okay, boy. Hi, excuse me. Yes. Where's the library? The library is next to the regis, regis, right? registration. 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 Registration office. I'm sorry, I'm new. Where is the registration office? No problem. See the big building over there? Yes. Okay, so that's the lecture theater. Theater. 
Theater, that, theater. Theater. Next to that, on the right, is the re registration office. And next to that is the library. I see. Thanks. Bien, Susi. Solo registration, registration, satisfaction, registration. californication. Okay. Oh, okay, <laughs> registration. Y este es theater, aunque dice teatre, es theater, theater, theater. Theater. Ok, como que la, la R la lleva al final. Yes. Theater. Sí, okay. fíjate que siento que tu pronunciación está mejorando. Solo hay palabritas. Pero sí. honestamente, eso sí, siento una gran diferencia a los módulos anteriores. He estado practicando un poco, de hecho, ahí estoy se metiéndole. Nota. Fíjate sí. que se nota, fíjate que se nota. Ajá. Ah, me alegro mucho. Así que sí, no, no, dale, dale con todos los poderes, me llega eso. Okay, Apuérdate bien, siempre fiel, nunca siempre. infiel. <risa> bye, Chao. Okay. bye, bye. Lady in red. Mm. Tengo una duda. ¿Cómo se dice teatro? Theater, theater. Eso es lo que estaba hablando con Susi. Ahí dice teatre, teatre. Pero es theater. 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 Okay. Theater. theater. Mm -hmm. Ok. And I need just to hear or to listen two couples. Ok, Carmen, please. Carmen and company. Para ese nombre de <laughs> Okay. Who's your you, who's your partner? Go Maritza. Maritza, please. Hi, excuse me. Ah, sorry. Empiezo yo. Hi, excuse me. Yes. Where's the library? The library. It's next to the registration office. Ah, sorry. I'm new. There's the registration office. No problem. See the big building over there? Yes. Okay, so that's the lecture theater. Next to that, on the right, is the registration oh, office. And next to that is the library. I see, thanks. Okay, good, perfect. Just one word, registration. Regi, registration. That's the only one, regi. Como el nombre de un compañero que tuve, regi. Okay, good. And then we're having... Um, what about if we we'll listen two more? Not two more, sino que dos más. For, for instance, Andrea. Okay, Andrea and company. And me. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. uh, solo una pregunta. Eh, teatro, ¿cómo se dice? Theater. Tía theater. como tu tía. Ter. Theater, okay. Como tía Teresa, pero sin esa. Theater, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Andrea. Hi, excuse me. Yes. Where is the library? The library is next to the registration office. Uh, sorry, I'm new. Where is the registration office? Uh, no problem. See the big building over there? Yes. Okay, so that's the lecture theater, theater. Next to that, on the right, is the registration office. And next to that is the library. I see. Thanks. Good. Library. That's the only library. one. Library. Una la dijiste, library, la otra library. Okay. <laughs> and the last one, Kevin. Okay, Kevin, go ahead. And then we continue with the next activity. Manuel. Okay, Manuel. Okay, okay. Men's power. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Dark, Kevin. Okay, hi. Excuse me. Okay. Where is the library? Library. It's next to the re registration office. Registration. Ah, sorry. I'm new. Where is the registration office? No problem. See the big building over there? Yes. Okay. So that's the lecture theater next to that. On the right is the registration E. Is the registration office, and next to the to that is the library. 
I see. Thanks. Ok, good. Perfect. Ok, thanks, my friends. Very good pronunciation. Vamos a estar practicando esas que son listenings. Ahora solo me voy a basar en conversations, short conversations. Creo que esa les va a ayudar en, mucha, en muchas cosas. Por ejemplo, I'm no problem. I'm sorry. Where is... Entonces, esas hacen, eh, they are going to help you to express like naturally. And that's one of the main objectives of this course. For you to have a better fluency and to sound naturally. Sonar natural. Okay. And do you remember, como dice en la canción, do you remember? Um, ID, la pronunciación del ID en el pasado, T, y la pronunciación de D, okay? So look at this, because we're having some, we're having a practice about it. Okay, and D. Vean el final de las consonantes, por ejemplo, planned, cleaned, explained, ok, en la T, asked, con K, miss, verdad, kiss, wash, and the other with ID, con ID, wait, count, uh -huh. casi, esas finalizan con T, con, con T principalmente, esa es la más fácil para mí, de la más fácil, y esta también. Esa es más confusa. Ok. So, now, let's see. Mm -hmm. We start with Diana. Lady in red. I need you to pick one. I'm sorry. Con mi vida, I'm sorry. Yes, yes, yes. Voy a lo siento, momento de crisis existencial. Ok. No problem. <laughs> D, I, D, T. So I need you to select uh, one of these sounds. Selecciona uno de estos sonidos y me dices el verbo. Ok. Por ejemplo, si me dices D, entonces me pronuncias con la D, el verbo, así como debe ser. Si, si alguien me dice I, D, eh, me selecciona el verbo y con I, D, ¿verdad? Y si es T, también, ¿verdad? Ok, so, eh, Diana, and then we're having Mercy. Mm, letter D. Sería mm -hmm. mm, hated. Sorry? Hated. Hate. Hated. Hated. Ajá, ¿con cuál es? D. Mm. ¿Sí? Mm -mm. Termina con la letra T. Uh, hate. ¿Cómo diría con la de hate? No. Mm. ¿Cómo así? O sea, sin haberlo okay. pasado. A... Ajá, vaya, vaya. Te voy a decir esto. El Esta... verbo es hate. ¿Y en pasado? Hate it. Hate it. Hate it. Hate it. Ah. Sería esta. Ya. ID. Ajá, ID sería ID. Bien, te voy a dar chance de otra. Ok, ya voy contigo. Who's next? Mercy, right? ID. Uh -huh. Fire. 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 Mm, this is fired. Sería D. Ok. Fire. Fired. Uh -huh. Traten de buscarle el sonido. A ver cuál. Suena como más lógico, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Ok, we go with Luis and then Carmen. Um, I think is with letter T. Kissed. Kissed. Mm -hmm. Para mí estas son las más fáciles, la de la T. Kissed. Aunque pronunciarlo cuesta, pero identificarlo es más fácil. Diana, ajá, Dianita, no te me escapas. De Kevin. Mm. Quiero ver, mm, sería. Invited. In, uh -huh. Invited. ¿Con qué termina? ID. Yes, invited. <laughs> yes. Okay. ¿Dónde está? Invited. Yes. Good. Okay. Uh, Kevin, right? Kevin, sí. and then we're going with Carito. 
Ok, con la letra D. Uh -huh. Happened. Happened. Sí. Happened. Yes. Happened. Good. Ok. Perfect. Uh, we're having Carito and then Mercy. Ok. Letter D. Uh -huh. Like. Like. Ajá. Uh -huh. ¿Con cuál es el sonido? Con T. Ah, Sorry. con T. Ah, ja, ja. <ríe> con T. Like. Uh -huh. Like. <ríe> Chacarita como... Retractándote. Como cuando sea una travesura y después... No, no. Ok. Eh, Mercy. No, no, no. Who's, who's next? ¿Quién le dije? Por estar pendiente de Carita. Se me fue. Ok. We continue with Andrea. And then Susi. Uh, ID. Hmm? Waited. Yes, waited. Thank you. Uh, Susi and then Maritza. Letter D, unite. 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 United. United, teacher. United. Termina con T. Unite. Okay, no puedes. I... Unite. United. Or United. Okay. United. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ni modo. Okay. <laughs> okay. Who's next? Maritza, um, then Elsa. P. Hmm? Hmm? Parked. Yes. Parked. 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 Yes. Good one. Elsa, and then we're having Helen. Okay, Helen, and then Christian. Okay, Helen. Mm. I learned D. Mm -hmm. Love. Yes, love. La enamorada. <laughs> Bárbara Helen. Ok, and who's next? Christian, dije, ¿verdad? Yes. Christian and Edgar, ok. Sería Poviri. No se escribe así. Ajá. Sería con ID. ¿Cuál? Poviri. Poviri. Poviri, yes. Terminante yes. Poviri. Good. Ok, um, eh, Edgar and then Kevin. En la primera, Omni, mm -hmm. con D. ¿Con D? Sí. Yes, Omni. Um, mm -hmm, perfect. Ok, Kevin and then we're having Carmen. Lo siento, teacher, estaba ocupado. Ok, I will give you time, te daré tiempo. Carmen. Eh, creo que con T, Jocket. Jocket. Mm -hmm. Ah, Jocket. <laughs> Let's do it. Okay, good. Okay, Kevin, now are you ready? Uh, sí. Mm -hmm. eh, con la letra D. Mm -hmm. Used. Used. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, used. Okay. And what about uh, Maritza again? And Diana again? Um, uh, with the mm -hmm. owned. Owned. Con D, yes, owned. Ahí está, ya está, owned. Ah, uh -huh. oh, pero eh, aquí está. Aquí está otra repetidas. vez. Por eso. Ah. Ah. Sí, también la de. United. Oh, United. Mm. Ok, thank you. Diana, and then Mercy. Again. Letter T, start. Yeah. Mm. Start. <laughs> Mira, Diana, me gusta que sea creativa, <risa> o sea, que inventas, pero no. Started, started. Started. Ay, no, ponchada. Sí, ponchadita por Malía. Ok, pues next. 
Merci. Merci. Uh -huh. Right. Right. ¿Cuál? Aquí, ajá, abajo, abajo. A fire. ¿Qué, no, ¿qué la, dices? ¿Qué letra? De la para. Right. Sí. Fired. No, pero aquí dice. No, de la, pa, la otra, la que sigue. Rushed. 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 Ajá, rushed. Y es T. Bien, Mercy. Good. Andrea. Eh, Susi me falta, creo. T. Es dressed. Uh -huh. Dressed. Uh -huh. Rush, ya estuvo, dress. Ok, me solo me faltan estas. One, me falta. One, two, three, four. Ok, Susie and then Edgar. Teacher, sorry, I confused, I confused uh, with this topic. ¿Me estás confundida en el amor? En este tema, teacher, es que yo no, es que vaya. Usted dice que de, debemos guiarnos por la última, pero cuando está en presente, eh, a veces te... Sí, creo que te cortaste. ¿Me escuchaba? ¿Te cortaste la pena? No, no, no te no. escuché. Es que, vaya, yo no entiendo porque, por ejemplo, luego le voy a decir en hate. Eh, en presente termina con E, entonces yo no entiendo cuál ponerle. La verdad que yo estoy confundida con este tema, no entiendo. Vaya, vaya. Terminamos esto y te voy a aclarar esa duda que es muy válida tu pregunta. ¿Ok, Susi? Ya le vamos a dar una revisión rápida. ¿Ok, Susi? A, tu pe a petición tuya. ¿Qué es eso? Bien. Eh, antes, para terminar, Mercy, Manuel. Tú me vas a decir, Manuel, porque no te he preguntado. Den, den Luis. Yeah. Diga. Va, esa ah. es la actitud. Esa es la actitud. Ajá, Manuel. Primera, ponchado. No, bueno. <risa> eh, switch, eh, switch. Switch. Con. Con. Uh, con, con. Ah, ya la regué. Con D. <risa> no, switch. <risa> con T. <risa> con T, va. Ajá, otra. Otra vez la misma. No, no otra, va. no, hombre, otra ah. diferente. Ajá, la misma no. Ajá, otra. Uh, part. 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 Ajá, vaya, seguí tu corazón. Tranquilo, respira. Ajá. ¿Con no, qué pues es? No, ya perdí. Dale, dale. Con T. T. Yes, part. Yes, good. Yo lo, yo lo recuerdo que dijo que las que terminaban con K. Ahí. Esas son las más fáciles. Esas son las más facilísimas porque todas terminan con las te, que terminan con K. O sea, la consonante. Eh, vamos a la, a la pregunta de Susi. Nos vamos a, a guiar en la consonante. En la consonante. ¿Ok? Eh, eh, Mercy y Andrea. Para que le quite el sueño a Andreita. Uh -huh. Mercy. Cualquiera de estas dos. Cycling. Cycling. Con T. Cycle. 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 Con T. Cycle. Ok. Andreita. Eh, con D. Fire. Fire. Perfect. Good. Eh, quizás. Eh, thank you. Tú si estuviste en esa clase que expliqué esto. ¿O te fuiste de parranda? Ay, no recuerdo, teacher. Solo lo, creo sí, que ¿Qué no, vas a andar recordando? Lo <risa> solo me acuerdo de que lo vi así como en la carrera. En una de las clases siguientes, me parece que la clase de esa no estuve. Yo creo que nadie Pero... estabas con todo bien. No, ahí no, no. Pero uh -huh. realmente yo me confundo, yo, o sea, estoy perdida. Pues no se confunda. No. Vaya, Susi, vamos a ver esto. Es válida tu pregunta, es muy válida, porque nadie la había hecho, realmente. Solo había explicado. Eh, los verbos normalmente se rigen por consonantes al final. Las consonantes son todas las que no son vocales. Las vocales son A, E, I, O, U, ¿verdad? Y en inglés, que todas las consonantes se pronuncian con la boca abierta. Si alguien me dice una consonante con, la, con los labios unidos, lo invito a comer. 
pero no se puede, ¿verdad? Entonces, aquí, por ejemplo, invite, no se dice invite, ¿verdad? Se dice invite. En el caso acá de cerrar, se dice, ¿sí puede ver eso? Eso sí. Sí, se dice close, no close. Entonces no, nos basamos, nos basamos en las consonantes finales. Y si terminan, aquí está, ¿ve? Si terminan en K, en S, ¿verdad? En X y todo eso, va a sonar como, como T. Si termina en T o en D, va a sonar como I, D. Counted. Aquí está esta vez. Hated. La que me dijo de Anita que me la quería cambiar. Invited. Tid. ¿Ya? Ahora. Las que son de, que para mí estas son un poquito más confusas, son las que terminan en toda esta. ¿ve? L, F, E, O, por ejemplo, answer, termina en R. Answer. Y que, otra que termina en prepare, no digamos prepare, prepared, plant, cold. ¿No es eso, sí? Más o menos. Sí, bueno, yo ya lo le entendí. Eh, no tengo que guiarme por la vocal, sino que por la consonante. Uh -huh. Ok. Por la, tienes que guiarte por la consonante y por tu corazón. Recuerda siempre que las vocales no se van a pronunciar, siempre son consonantes. Eh, mm, la, las consonantes son las la claves. Entonces, es de revisar esto. Ya, es, es estar como acostumbrarse. Pero como les decía, la T más fácil. Y la ID es la más fácil, porque mira, todo lo que termina en T, ID, un verbo, se va a decir ID. Para mí, eso es lo más, la guía más práctica. La T también nos cuesta mucho. La D es la que mmm, nos da como, nos pone en duda. Teacher, pero siempre nos vamos a guiar para saber el sonido en, cuando el verbo esté en presente. Toda la vida, toda la vida. Uh -huh. Ya. Esto es para verbos regulares, ajá. Por ejemplo, miss, miss, ajá. Porque sí es que después se le agrega, ¿verdad? Cross, cross, ¿verdad? Relax, relax. Ya. Yeah. Sé que es, es un tema un poco confuso. No sé si ya tengo, estoy llorando por ustedes. No, no sé si ya, si ya tenemos como cuatro días viendo esto. Y... De la ex? No, bebé, oil. <ríe> como dicen, oil. No, no, para nada. Este, realmente ese es un tema bien complejo. No es tan fácil. Y cuando, si ustedes sienten que no le están entendiendo así completely, eh, no, no se angustien, ¿verdad? Porque sí es un tema amplio que no se eh, puede memorizar o aprender en una sola clase o en dos. Lleva su, su, su proceso, ¿ok? Así que es eso. Solo es de revisar esta lista que les di. Y eso les va a ayudar, ¿verdad? Así que no se aflijan ni, ni se sientan así como agobiados, ¿no? Chill ya siento que me reprueba. Que no, pues sí, como dice Manuel, ya me poncharon, ok. So that's it. Eh, 20 minutes, 20 minutos. Y ya casi terminamos, 20 minutes, ok. So, um, ya que tenemos esto, vaya, Susi. Vamos a la prueba de fuego. Si te equivocas es porque vas a tener tres babies el otro año. Bien, vamos a ver. Ok, eh, con T, Kit. Right? Kit, ¿cuál es Kit? Kit, Kit. Ah, Kit. Um, va, va, uh -huh. ya viste, está fácil. Vaya, uh, vamos a ver otro que se me confundió. Fue Tianita, Lady in Red. Se me confundió con una. Uh -huh. Ok. Hey, it. Uh -huh. eh, ah, la primera que me había dicho con D, ajá, hate it. Te eh. viste, bye. Easy peasy. Muy bien, continuamos. Ok, where did you grow up? What do you remember the most? Um, I will need the help of. Manuel, please. Sí. I grew up in Pastor Peque. San Vicente. Uh -huh. uh, and what do you remember the most? I remember uh, my, grandf my grandmother. 
uh, my grandfather. Okay. Uh, como ellos siempre lo quieren tener a uno así como que uh, bien consentido. Uh, cada mm -hmm. vez que llegaba a verlo. De verdad. Uh, mm -hmm. How lucky, qué suertudo. Uh -huh. No comer, igual. Ah, no, pues sí. <ríe> Normalmente. Sí, eso es lo que... Normalmente sí, y te sirven bastante. Yes, that is. Uh -huh. Todavía Pero... me dicen. Uh -huh. ¿Ah? No, sí, lo consienten aún. Todavía me dicen Josuecito a mí, todavía, imagínate. So that's it. Yeah. Yes. Yo le digo, okay. sí, sí. <risa> <risa> ok, ok. Ok, so thank you, Manuel. Mercy, your turn to be famous. Ok. No lloré, es tranquila, mujer. Que <risa> Dale. Go ahead. I grew up. Ah. I grew up. I grew up in the department of Sonsonate. Mm -hmm. And what I remember most is that there was a river near the house and we went every day with my brothers. Yes, that's the bus. The amazing thing to have a river, oh, not tan cerca, but yes, uh, to have a river near the house is one of the best things. De hecho, ahí aprendí a nadar cuando me tiraron una poza accidentalmente. <laughs> Te tiraron accidentalmente, ok. Sin poder nadar, entonces ahí aprendí. Así vamos a tirar a Dianita, a Susie, a los demás ahí. Ok, so fine. Thank you, um, eh, Mercy. Good. Good to hear that. Uh, what if we listen to Carito? Are you there? Yes, I will. Please. Okay, I grew up in Mexicans. And I remember the most is when I cleaned, así se dice. Escalar o limpiar. No, escalar. Climb. Mm -hmm. Climb. The mango tree. And ah. I love it. I love it being their early mangos. Así se dice. Early. Tierno. Sí. <laughs> y maduro. Ok, ok. Mature es maduro. Ajá. Early. Sí, podemos decir. Sí, posiblemente. Sí, sí no te voy a confirmar. Ajá. Ah, ok. <laughs> ok. Did you fail? Did you fall down? Anytime? ¿Te caíste alguna vez? No. No, no. It is very common that when you climb, at least once, you you fall down. Alguna vez te caes. Al menos una vez. Todos nos hemos caído alguna vez. Pero si tú no, ya tenía experiencia. Okay. Ya está sobre la cejita. Okay. Perfect. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Carito. Uh, here we have also Edgar. Are you there? Yes, teacher. Please tell me. Okay, uh, I grew up in Sonsonate City. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, what I remember the most is waiting to get get out of class uh, and in the afternoon go uh, uh, if I go with my friends and uh, play. Um, play, jugar, uh, play or play to the family. Uh -huh. What are the family? No, uh, no. Uh, no amigos. Uh, Our uh, friends play soccer, uh -huh. play different soccer. games, or go out with them to place um, that we would like to go. Okay, yeah, that's one of the best things, especially when you went out earlier, con salía más temprano de clases. Hmm? Take advantage of the time. O escaparse en su defecto. Escape. Okay. Thank you, Edgar. And now let's listen to um, Susie. Okay. Um, I, grew, I grew up in Suyapango. In fact, I have always spent my life here. Science I was born and until now. I remember the most that I played I Played. I played with my neighbors daily in the afternoon after escondidas, no sé cómo se dice, teacher. Hide and seek. 
hide and sit. Mm -hmm. Mañana voy a ver si les traigo lo, algunos jueguitos que uno hacíamos. ¿Cómo se dice en inglés? Mm -hmm. Hide and seek. Ok. So, mm -hmm. hide and seek. ¿Y te encontraban? Eso sí. Mm, muchas veces sí. Ok. Hide and seek. Yes, it, it, it's a good game. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Susie. You have always lived in Soyapango, right? Yep. Okay. Always Soyapango. Soya City. Okay, thanks. Uh, let's continue with this. Here we have some sentences. Uh, I need you to order them. And we're going to start with Carito, que me hizo una cara de, ah, ya no, teacher, okay. Carito, la primera. And then, after this, we're having Luis. Is the question, ¿verdad? Some of them are questions. Si ves la question mark, si ves el signo de interrogación, yes. it's a question. Okay. Did you... What number? Number one, sorry. Number one is... Did you enjoy the training? The training, right. yes. Did right. you enjoy the training? Perfect. Okay, who's next? Mm, Luis. It's me. Luis yes. and Luis and after Manuel. Okay. Okay. I think uh, the, the what manager. What number? Number sorry. two. Number two. Okay. I hope it's very good. Very easy. But uh, the seminar didn't attend. The man. No. The manager didn't attend the seminar. Yes, the manager. No, fue el jefecito al seminario. Good. Manuel, and then we're having um, Carmen. Number four. Uh, the supervisor, uh, the exchange business card. Yes, the supervisor exchange the business cards. Yes, good one. Okay, Carmen, and then Christian. Ya me la quitaron, teacher. Así es la vida. Yo, ¿cuántas veces no he dicho eso, Carmen? Ok. Híjole. Ah, la de... ah, I need more time. También me han dicho eso. Ok. <risa> eh, let's see, let's see. Who, who was? Christian. Carmen, three or four. Si no, también te la van a ganar. Uh, three. Three, va reservada, como las pupusas. Okay, uh, Christian, are you ready with number five? Okay, if Christian is not ready, let's go with um, Andrea. Creo que sería my, my warmate didn't the network conven at convention. Mm -hmm. But, mm -hmm. My workmates is como my colleagues, my partner. My mm -hmm. workmates mm -hmm. didn't didn't network. Mm -hmm. Ese es el verbo. Didn't network mm -hmm. at at convention at the convention. Mm -hmm. at network the convention. es como socializar, wow. ajá, y todo eso. Okay, good, okay. Andrea. Perfect. Yo que me hace burla. Okay. Eh, Carmen. No, no estoy segura, teacher. No importa, no, porque uh, nadie está seguro en esta vida. Pues, the, the personal update the maintenance certification. Yes, the personal updated. 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 The maintenance certifications, yes. <gasps> okay, good. Perfect. Um, nine minutes, nine minutes. Okay. Esta actividad, vamos a ver si la alcanzamos a hacer. Okay. Where do you grow up? What do you remember the most? And let's start with Diana. And after Diana, with Edgar. I oh, know, with Elsa. Okay, Danita. Yes, please. Okay, I grew up in Apopa and I remember the most is spending time with my friends. 
Mm -hmm. Okay. That spend time with your friends. You have always lived in a popa, right, Diana? No. No. Mm. Now, um, where do you live now? In San Salvador. In San Salvador. Okay. So your family is from Apopa? Yes. Okay. Thank you. Good. And Elsa and then Helen. Elsa, are you there? Okay, no. Helen, please. Um, I grew up in Sonsonate. I remember that it hit my neighbor because he ignored me. Mm. Te ignoraba, ignored you. Pero te ignoraba en qué sentido? Es que no me hacía caso. Pues sí, no te hacía caso en qué sentido. Y él no quería. Es que no quería, eso. perdón. I'm sorry. Es que él no me hacía caso cuando yo le decía que jugáramos de algo. Eh, ok. Um, <laughs> I think that's a lot of information. Creo que hay mucha información. <laughs> uh -huh. So it was the soccer, it was uh, the football, jugar a la familia, o jugar a la tiendita, sí, or what? Muñecas y él no le gustaba. Ah, yeah, that's why dolls, las muñecas, uh, and especially when Boys are, are like from <laughs> 7 to 12. They don't want to play anything. Yes, that's why. You want, you want him to push. Do you want him to push? Yes. Qué intensa. Okay, Helen. Okay. <laughs> Pobrecito. Okay, Kevin, your turn. Esta Helencita dice las cosas así, pausadas. Y no se asusta. Okay, Kevin, your turn. I grew up in Cincinnati city. And I remember the most, the Christmas with my family, with my friends. And also I can remember uh, the soccer tournaments and things like that. Yes, uh, very specific and good points. Uh, Christmas and soccer tournaments are always like amazing. Uh, you are always like very happy when you participate in those events, okay? Thanks very much. Thanks, Kevin. And, and we're going, no, reading for tomorrow. What's the name of this song? Bien, tenemos dos actividades para mañana. Tres, de hecho, que, pues, casi no tuvimos mucho tiempo. Helen, nos va a cantar. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Close your eyes. Heal me your health, darling. Do you feel my health beating? Do you are the same? Do you feel the same? Or I only dream? It this morning an eternal flame. I believe it means to be deadly. I was you when your eyes sleeping. You belong to me. Do you feel the same? Close your eyes. Heal me your health Darling, do you feel my hair beating? Mm -hmm. Ya sé qué canción es. I know that song. Creo que se la dedicabas a tu vecino. Ok. <laughs> yes. The yes. Eternal Flame. <laughs> mm, qué romántica, Helen. Ok. And I don't know who is the singer. Do you remember or do you know the name of this girl? Because it's a girl. Mm -hmm. Does anybody know? ¿Alguien no. sabe? No. Bien. Creo que de esta canción. ¿Sorry? De band. Band. Ah, it's a no band. Es, es una banda. Creo que sí, creo que sí. De Bengley. No sé si es así. Really? Una mujer, ¿cómo que es? Yes. Yo creo que esta canción es la que Helen le, se la dedica. No. La vieja <risa> confiable, que es la, el modus operandi de Helen. Good, Helen. Very romantic. Hasta en rosadito. Sí, pues, yes. Can you see the details? ¿Se pueden ver el detalle? El nivel. <laughs> okay. Um, we have this. Okay. We're not having too much time to do this, but the activity is that 
You have to create your business card. Tienen que crear una tarjeta de negocios. We're not doing it uh, right now, but we're going to do it tomorrow. La vamos a hacer mañana, okay? So, what info should be present uh, or should be, aquí le falta ed, what info should be presented in business card? For all of you, QR codes, job title, social media links, telling line, mail address, name, company log. Okay, so we're going to do it tomorrow. La vamos a hacer mañana because we are going uh, out of, of time. So I'm going to check the attendance list. Please say hello and then let's go to sleep, everybody. I hope you, you go to bed early tonight. Espero. Ana Mercedes, merci. Yo. Thank you, Andrea. Hi, teacher. Hello, Carmen. Present. Okay, Claudia, not here. Carolina, Carito. Good night. Good night. Maritza. Present. Good. Christian. Present. Good. Diana, lady in red. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Edgar. Present teacher. Good one. Uh, Elsa, not here. Uh, I guess she wants to sleep. Helen, the, le, the romantic girl. Romantic, <laughs> romantic side of the world. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Hi, gente. Jonathan is not here. Kevin. Kevin, are you there? Hello, Luis. Hi, teacher. Hello. Uh, Manuel. Hi. Hoy has estado super callado, Manuel. But very quiet. He estado demasiado callado hoy. Uh, así somos. <laughs> okay. Susi. Present. Hello. Como dice, rosadito dice. Okay, um, remember to finish the midterm. Me uh, fijé, I checked in the morning, revisé en la mañana y pocos habían hecho the midterm. I hope you have completed it uh, during the day or you can do it tonight. Necesito pasar esas notas. And units, también las unidades eh, son necesarias. Please do it. If not, you're going to have more, more work to the next um, week or uh, you're going to be like accumulated work for the last week and you don't want that. Ustedes no quieren acumular trabajo, ¿verdad? Así que please do it, eh, háganlo, ¿verdad? Si lo pueden hacer ahora, si no lo han hecho. So, for the rest, see you tomorrow. Los veo mañana, okay? Bye-bye. Bye, -bye. Bye good evening. Good evening. Hoy nadie se queda los 10 minutos. Yes, yes, yes. Hoy se queda Elsa. Se me fue okay. ahorita lo que escribí. Thanks. Bye. Good evening. Bye bye.
Okay, I was waiting for the student, but unfortunately, uh, she's not going to be um, with us. So, um, to take advantage of this time, um, I'm going to, or oh, we're going to have a review of the content we have studied this class. The name is Unit 2 Review and Practice, class number 10. Here we have uh, some of the, this is a puzzle. So you can find different words uh, in this chart. Words that have been studied previously in the contents uh, that we studied before during the, the last uh, classes. So uh, there can be found some words, for instance, industry, staff, networking, branch, guest, headquarters, small talk, manufacturer, personnel, expertise. Definitely. You can find some of this, for instance. Manufacture. Headquarters. Stuff. Small talk. Personal. Expertise. Networking. The industry. Branch. Yes. So these are the vocabulary. Uh, sorry, the, these are the words identified in the puzzle. 